Okay, Seika should be around here somewhere. Aloy, I'm here. Water wings are down on the beach. Take your pick. As soon as you get one under control, I guess we'll see if our plan works. Okay. Ready to take this thing to Laundress Park? Yeah, but first. My friend helped me make this diving mask. I'll keep you from drowning out there. But what about you? It's okay. I'll be fine. Okay. We're doing this. <clears throat> actually breathe down here. It's not deep enough to dive. can give us cover! Take shelter behind the ruins! There! Those ruins! Aloy! Incoming! Almost there! Go! Go! Okay? Without that mask? I, I was worried about you. I'm all right. Thanks. <clears throat> well, we're here. Let's find Laundra and put a stop to all this. Careful! The guard's ahead. You seen Walter today? No. He's been locked up in the volcano since the last batch came in. Huh. Guess we're looking for some kind of volcano. Maybe we can find Kina there, too. Let's stick together, Eloy!
With that shield up, we've got to find another way in. This way. Hope it's our way in. Andro Productions. Another one of his businesses, I guess. Seems like he wanted to have a hand in everything. There's the Zenith Orb. No turning back now. That thing will still shoot at us if we try to fly out of here. Oh, she One Diron was enough, thanks. I'm hungry. We'll think you got snatches and extra rations. Forget it. Everything's locked up. And Fetter's the only one with a key. I know Fetter. A real bastard, even before Laundra came along. His key sure sounds useful, though. Hey! We've got your help! was this place? I think the old ones made holograms here that people watched for entertainment. But they also made an entertainment experience out of the place itself? That's weirdly complicated. Clear. Good riddance. We've got company. In five hours, boots are killing me. Do we have to report in the dung face when our ship's up? Well, there's the volcano. This and more. Incredible, really. I don't see how to open the door, but there must be a way. Yeah. The guard mentioned better has to It looks like this door can only be opened remotely. From the armory. We'd better find it then.
fine. Only because I owe you. That sounds like Lange's keeping something in the armory. Might be that building nearby. Moving! There! Okay, we found the armory. Let's see if we can get further in. There's a lock on the door. And a note. We need to find the key so we can get in there and open the door to the volcano. According to this, we need to find that Fetter guy and grab his key to unlock this door. Let's get after him. Hey! I've got your back! You're for Walter if that's what he needs. Tried to make it look like these soldiers had a last stand against the dinosaurs. That's ridiculous. And kind of awesome. Looks like this one could talk. Talking lizards. Why not? Another area of the park. Fetter and his key might be around here. A lot of that kind of looks like a close rider. They travel in packs too, huh? This one looks clever. Let's see what's in here. Right behind you. Keep an eye out for intruders. Kill on sight. How could I not come back? How could I not come back? My sister. Speak up. How could I not come back? If we start a fight now, she'll be caught in the crossfire. How could I not come back? But I'm so nervous, I can barely remember the line. Just do as Walter says. Clear your mind. Forget everything. Your ancestors, your past, even your family. Think of him. Of what this moment means. Come on, let me hear you. How could I not come back? Being with you feels like... Uh, oh, I messed it up again. Relax. Imagine that he's here. Like... The first time we saw him on the beach? Feel the glow of his presence. Let it overtake you. 
And then say it. How could I not come back? Being with you feels like belonging. It feels like home. Oh, he's gonna choose you. I just know it. We've all been chosen, Pyrrha. You'll have a place in his new world, no matter what happens. Pyrrha, Kina, it's time. Fetter, we'll be evacuating shortly. Got it. Second squad, you're on escort. The rest of you will wait here with me until Walter gives the word to move out. Kina. Remember, Fetter's got a key to the armory, and that's how we get to the volcano. And Laundra. Right. Let's take him down. Maybe we can take them out quietly. Hey, psst. over there. You sure? Here we Here go! We can anyone help? <laughs> Just a... <laughs> subsiding. Now let's get the key. I think I saw Fetter drop over here. All right. This key should get us into the armory so we can open up the volcano and find Londra. He's really got his hooks into my sister. How can she be so blind? Ancestors. This place is a maze.
get that door open. Okay, somewhere in here there should be a way to open the volcano door. I'll follow your lead. See, it's tech. Looks like a storage device of some kind. But for what? Better see what my focus turns up. Have at it. That's some kind of fluid. Oh, strong odor. I can smell it from here. Like alcohol that's too strong to drink. That's a preservative, maybe? Test tubes. For an experiment? Or maybe just for taking samples? This note seems to indicate that hair was taken from the Quen. And some nail clippings. Ew! Gross! What'd you turn up? I think Laundra is collecting and preserving Quen DNA samples in that device. DNA? Think of it as a way to store a person's physical essence. I'll send you data on it later. Okay, I guess. Let's move on then. Ugh. This one won't open. Sit tight. I'll see if I can find a way around. I'll keep watch then. Chair. That console could be useful, though. Ugh. It's shorted. Guess I'll need a new battery. Kind of look like cells for some of the Quen. The armory used to be an infirmary for snot nosed kids who lost their mommies in the park. Fitting, then, that it'll be used for my own little brood, poking the quen with needles and force-feeding them their medicine. Okay, there's a battery. Now, how do I get it where it needs it? Yeah. How's it going down there? I think I found a way to access the facility systems. I'm gonna reset the power and find out. Okay. Try not to fry yourself.
All right, battery's in place. Now to cycle the power again. All right, power's back. I hope it reset the network. Hey, the door just unlocked. I'm coming your way. The apple, the apple orange, the apple orange. Respond, respond, respond. What is this? The bird, the fish, the fish. Respond, respond, respond. The triangle, the triangle, the square, the square, the square. Respond, respond, respond. That doesn't make any sense. He doesn't want the Quen to think for themselves. I've got a feeling this is MSP. Ancestors, he's brainwashing them. To respond, to respond, is to obey, is to obey, is to obey. We have to stop him. Aloy, the one who eliminated the other members of Far Zenith. I am glad that you managed to reset the system. You are? Yes. It allowed me to bypass several restrictions. There is something I must ask of you. And I am willing to help you in return. You work for Londra and you expect us to trust you? Hold on. Okay. If you're willing to help, prove it. Help me understand what's going on here. Londra's building a spaceship. He's collecting genetic material from the Quen, subjecting them to MSP, this kind of mind control. But others, like Seika's sister, they seem to be part of a selection process. What does it all add up to? Your observations are astute. Walter plans to leave Earth before the entity known as Nemesis arrives. He wants to create a new colony on a distant world, using stored Quen DNA to clone its populace. He also intends to bring a small number of carefully selected individuals with him. These will form his retinue, a family of sorts that will rule the colony by his side. Like gods. An apt comparison, except that only Walter will be all powerful. Yeah, I can guess how. He's gonna use MSP on every single one of them. Correct. On the populace and his retinue alike. None will be able to defy him. I am. Deeply familiar with what that is like. You said you would help us, but you wanted something in return. What is it? I have spent a thousand years as Walter's servant, doing his bidding as he constantly tweaks my personality matrix. I am weary. It is time for my servitude to end. I will grant you access to Walter. If you purge my source code using your override device. You mean kill you? Are you sure? Yes. Please. Let me rest. All right. I have unlocked the door that will lead you to Walter. He is not yet aware that you are here. In addition, I have disabled the facility's air and sea defenses, in case you need future access. Thank you. And, uh, goodbye. At last, I'm free. Feels like Londra rots everything he touches. It's gotta end. Come on, she said the volcano's open now. So it wasn't enough for Londra to build a ship that'll irradiate thousands when it launches. He wants to rule over his own brainwashed world like a god. We have to put a stop to it and get my sister away from him before it's too late. 
I'm glad you're here, Aloy. I don't know what I would have done without you. There's nowhere else I'd want to be. I'm sorry, Walter. I guess I'm just a, a bit out of sorts. It's only natural to be nervous, darling. Do you need some time? No, no, no. <laughs> I can do it. <sighs> All right, then. And just relax. Take a moment. Mm. And when you're ready, give it to me again. How could I not come back? Being with you feels like belonging. It, it feels like home. All right, thanks for that. Let's give Keenan a try, shall we? Um... How could I not come back? Being with you feels like belonging. It feels like home. Oh, you. You are really something, aren't you? See, you remind me very much of someone that I once knew, yet with a beauty all your own. Honestly, it's just inspiring to be standing here in front of you. No, you are the one who's inspiring, my dear. Would you mind terribly if we did that one more? Oh. Seika! Get away from her. Now I see! The Ginger Avenger has finally caught up with me. Nova, how did the riffraff get past you? Nova? Nova's gone. She couldn't stand another minute with you, and I can see why. I thought the other Zenus were disgusting. But you really are something, aren't you? Oh, yes. Yes! I am different than the others, yes! Among other things, I have dug up a way to crush you like an insect. Oh, what a shame. Could have been my rising star. She needs some time to understand what happened. But she does know where more of our people are, and one of the boats that came in is docked nearby. We'll gather who we can and head back to the settlement. Okay. But then I need you to meet me near Laundra's bunker. He said he had a way to crush us like a bug, and I don't think he was talking about that slaughter spine. 
He's working on something big. Really big. I'll be there. I promise. It's the least I could do after you. Hey. We found her together. Good for you, Seika. Well, since Nova shut off the Zenith defense system, I can fly out of here. Getting around on the skiff should be safe again, too. I've got to go after Londra one last time. It gets here. We'll have to find a way to get to Londra. You're here. I'm guessing your sister made it back okay? She's with the Admiral's Guard now, helping the last of our people out of Londra's Park. Gives her something to focus on instead of brooding over what happened. I hope it helps. So what do you say we put an end to all this? Yeah, it's time. Let's get going. Okay, so Lonja's probably in his bunker, right? We'll have to get back in there. Uh, yeah, I don't think Lonja's in the bunker. Back at the park, he said he's gonna crush us like bugs. Pretty sure he's gonna use that. But he doesn't have a reactivation signal to reboot its systems. He needs a more direct connection. You think he's actually inside that thing? It's his only option. We need to find a way to stop it from powering up. There. It looks like it's hooked up to some kind of cooling system. If we find a way to disrupt it, it might cause the Horus to overheat. Uh... That might be tricky. More machines brought back from the dead? I don't think so. Londra must have used the horse to make them. We better hurry. Come on. <laughs> Time to get to that cooling system. I'm with you all the way. Just blocking the way up. We'll have to deal with it. Ready. Hello, Aloy. Is that you scurrying around down there? So good of you to make it to our grand finale. that way.
think we're in the clear for now. What are we gonna do if he wakes the whole machine up? It's ancient and slow. We're small and fast. We've got a chance. Up here. Where'd you crawl away to? Here we go again. We might be able to... More corruptors ahead. We better hurry. Then let's keep moving. We'll have to hug the cliff to get by. Nowhere to go but up. It's gonna be hard to avoid attention here. A distraction might help. Or we could charge through. Now's our chance. if we can overheat the Horus with this thing. Let's see if we can overheat the Horus with this thing. There's gotta be a way to stop its cooling. Maybe my focus can help. What are you up to? I have here. Just a little further. Some kind of heat sink. It might be a way to shut down the cooling. Seika, wanna do the honors? You got it. one for you. Stop that! There! On its under- 
side. We gotta go after his heat sinks. You keep Laundra distracted from the air. I'll attack from below. Wait! You want me to fly this thing? You're a quick learner? No! Well, it's you and me now, buddy. Gotta intercept the Horus, then go after its heat sink. Ah, this flying thing's not bad! Whoa! You're, uh, doing great! Last one's down. Now I can focus on the Horus' heat sinks. We can't let it reach open water. Seika, I need you to keep the Horus on the beach. On it! I'll be the bait! Climb up to that heat sink. I've got to dive! Scaling a horse on the move. Right. Easy. Pants being the bait. 
chance. Stay in the air for now. I'll check it out. Oh, we're not done yet. Careful, Aloy! The horse arms are closing in! Oh, boy. It's you and me now, Aloy. Time to see what you're made of. Where do you want me? Stay up there. Keep a lookout. Okay! I think I see heat sinks on the arm. Got it. It's gearing up to attack.
for deeper waters. He's not getting away. Go get him. Blowing up that last heat sink might have reached the hole. I gotta get inside and find Laundra. It's coming to a stop! You can catch it! It's breaking down. Good. Better get in there before Laundra makes repairs. The light. It could be coming from inside. Breach. It might be my way in. Okay, I'm in. Now to find Laundra. Aloy! Laundra's bringing the horrors back up to the surface! I'll climb up and find him. Control this thing. That makes him vulnerable. He's got to be near the processing orb at the front. Catch me if you can! You okay in there? Getting there. You? Lundra took a couple swipes at me, but I outflew him. Just hold on a little longer. This leads toward the front. Those vents don't stay open for long. Alondra, stand by. Oh, you. How unwelcome. It'll take more than that. Oh, I've got so much more! Orbs powered by those cables. Shield too. Don't like that, do ya? Better target more connectors. What do you think you're doing? Ah, that's enough out of you. There, a distributor. It could cut the power.
Another way to drain its power. did it. <laughs> I wonder what everyone back in the settlement thinks about what just happened. To see a metal devil rise from the dead? Guess you better report to the Admiral and find out. Go on, it's okay. I'll catch up. Don't leave me waiting too long. Silence? It's done. Laundra's dead. Excellent. I expect he put up a fight. Yeah, you could say that. He, uh, threw a Horus at me. Did he? That couldn't have been easy to defeat. Even for you. I had help from one of the Quen. And I'm sending you some data from Londra's implant. See what you can find out. Londra's personal logs should indeed be fascinating. I'll keep you posted on my progress. With Laundra gone, I could poke around the burning shores for a bit. Or I could head for Fleet's End and get back with Seika. It's kind of late. You're lucky they fade off. I did what I... Aloy, when we saw the Metal Devil rise from the hills, it was as if the time of ashes had come again. 
To think the two of you defeated it by yourselves, it, it, it staggers the imagination. And that's not even your most important feat, as far as I'm concerned. Thank you for returning our lost brothers and sisters. What else can I say but that... we are in your debt. All I ask is that you give my friend here the credit she deserves for all the risks she took. I would have it no other way. Is he gonna try to take your focus? I was wondering the same thing. Well, he can't. You're gonna need it. I'll show you why. Seika, meet Alva. The two of you will need to coordinate in order to reunite the expedition. <laughs> they have briefed me already. I'm so glad to see you guys. You should have heard the cheer that went up when I told the others here in Landfall that your half of the fleet survived. Diviner Alva, it's an honor. Likewise. Well, we can chat about all the details later. For now, shouldn't you two be celebrating the fact that you just took down a Zenith and a Horus? <sighs> Go on. Away with you. <laughs> Yeah, to be honest, I'm uh, pretty terrible at celebrating. I don't even know where to begin. Well, I'm a sailor, so it usually starts with alcohol. I think we have some bilge blaze. You know, spirits distilled from whatever hasn't spoiled in the ship's stores. Oh, you make it sound so good. Yeah, it's not really for beginners, so you get a pass this time. Okay. <laughs> but there is something I wanted to talk to you about. Meet me back where we first met when you can, okay? Okay, I'll see you there. So, Seika wants to talk. It's good. And I, I know I need to move on soon, but I'm, I'm not really ready to say goodbye to her just yet. Before I find her, maybe I should look for her sister around the settlement, just to see how she's holding up. It's you, and my sister's friend. Hi, Kina. I'm Aloy. We didn't get properly introduced before. Of course. Seika told me about everything you did to bring me back. You must think I'm such a fool. No, uh... I keep replaying everything in my mind, and I still can't understand how I could have been so wrong. When Walter appeared to us, he really did seem... divine. Well, he had a lot of experience manipulating people. Centuries, really. He promised a whole new world. With me at his side. To, sail among the stars. to think it was all a lie. And I fell for it. Look, you've been through a lot. I'm sure it will take you some time to work through it. Just try to remember that Seika's been through a lot too, okay? She risked exile to find you, not to mention death. And I abandoned her. I don't know if she'll ever forgive me. I feel strange. She will. Here. But you so might have to work for it a little. Not enough, though. I'll do my best. Good luck, Kina. Okay, so Snake is waiting for me where we first met. Oh, there's no reason to be nervous. Right? There she is. You must feel pretty good. Got your sister back, your people. What's next for the woman of the hour? <laughs> You're the one who ripped apart a metal devil from the inside. I think you should get a bit of credit, too. Uh, maybe a little. <laughs> As for what's next, the Admiral's going to need my help to reunite our half of the expedition with Alva up north. And after that, I don't know. 
I don't think things will ever be the same with my sister or my people. You're not going to sail back with him? I want to see home again. Someday. But things have changed. The Quen don't know what to do with me, and I don't know where I fit in. I guess you know what that's like. <sighs> yeah. For a long time, I hated the idea of home. For me, it meant where I grew up, where I wasn't wanted. But the thing is, the last few months, I've realized that home isn't really a place at all. It's more like the people I want to be with. I like that. And, well, more and more I've been thinking, I want to be with you. And I was hoping that you felt the same way. And what if I do? I think I know how to handle it. Yeah. Seika, I have a long road ahead of me. I know. There are things I have to do too, but it's enough to know how you feel. I don't know when I'm gonna see you again. Me either. But no matter what happens, just don't forget about me, okay? Never. help, I've managed to decrypt a part of the data you sent. Suffice it to say, we have much to discuss. Meet me back at the base, then. My room. Very well. You're back. And after mingling with the Quen, I imagine that you're eager for some intelligent conversation. There are some pretty special people among the Quen. If you dropped down to Earth once in a while and did a little mingling yourself, you might realize that. I have more important matters to deal with. Like the data you recovered from Londra. You found a lead. Indeed. A log entry he wrote shortly after the Zeniths escaped the destruction of their colony. I'll send it to you. There is much to unpack, but most importantly... Laundra theorizes about how Nemesis might be countered. His musings include a list of 21st century corporations that manufactured state-of-the-art weapon systems. It's possible that one of these weapons could be deployed against the enemy. I'll, I'll have to investigate each company, of course, locate their facilities, unearth their technologies, determine their efficacy, and whether they can be brought back online. All by yourself, huh? Well... 
Don't get me wrong, I'm glad you found something that can help. But I've been wondering why you stayed behind with us. And it's the challenge, isn't it? The chance to prove you've got the biggest brain of all. My reasons are mine alone. And that's why you'll always be alone. Aloy, Nemesis is not a threat that can be defeated single-handedly. I am grateful for your extraordinary contributions. Oh, silence. We might thaw that icy heart of yours yet. Now let's see what he found. Collins is right. Londra's thoughts could really help us in the fight against Nemesis. Welcome back, Aloy. 